Learn from God to enlighten your soul. This is your daily devotional reading. Our Father cares, January 8th. We receive a faith that works by love. For in Jesus Christ, neither circumcision availeth anything, nor uncircumcision, but faith which worketh by love. Galatians 5 verse 6 When you present your petitions to the Lord, it should be in humility, without boasting of superior attainments, but with real soul hunger for the blessing of God. Christ always knows what is cherished in the heart. We must come in faith that the Lord will hear and answer our prayers, for whatsoever is not of faith is sin. Genuine faith is the faith that works by love and purifies the soul. A living faith will be a working faith. Should we go into the garden and find that there was no sap in the plant, no freshness in the leaves, no bursting buds or blooming flowers, no signs of life in stalk or branches, we would say the plants are dead. Uproot them from the garden, for they are a deformity to the beds. So it is with those who profess Christianity and have no spirituality. If there are no signs of religious vigor, if there is no doing of the commandments of the Lord, it is evident that there is no abiding in Christ, the living vine. Faith and love are the essential, powerful, working elements of Christian character. Those who possess them are one with Christ and are carrying forward his mission. We are to sit at Christ's feet as continual learners and to work with his gift of faith and love. We shall then wear Christ's yoke and lift his burdens and Christ will recognize us as one with him, in heaven it will be said, Ye are liberals together with God. Will our youth remember that without faith it is impossible to please God? And it must be faith that works by love and purifies the soul. We cannot overestimate the value of simple faith and unquestioning obedience. It is by following in the path of obedience and simple faith that the character obtains perfection. Our Father cares, January 8th.